Yeah, it's exciting to live in a progressive state like California that targets now 100% renewables. But I want to ask you, how realistic is that target? So to give you a feeling, NREL predicted to get us from 40 to 50% renewables with current generation takes 10 gigawatt of flexible storage. So 10 gigawatt is equivalent to 10 nuclear power plants or um, yeah, 1,700 years of battery production. So the only path forward to 100% renewables is through diversification. And here, wave power is the third largest resource with the advantage of being more stable, more predictable, and 50 times more power dense. As we can see on the chart, it greatly complements wind on an annual basis and solar on a daily basis. Uh, progress, please. So looking back, uh, wind is now yeah, one of the cheapest forms of renewables, but not long ago, it wasn't clear how the leading turbine would look like. And for wave power, we still don't have such a solution yet. So wind turned out to be the leading, uh, the up, three blade upwind design turned out to be the leading technology because it's the most efficient and it can be effectively shut down. So for wave power, we're still looking for exactly the same technology. So CalWave has finally found a solution that solves exactly the same criteria as the wind turbine. It's the most efficient and we can effectively shut it down. We operate fully submerged and yet proven to yeah, outperform the competition. Because of these features, we awarded by the US Wave Energy Prize out of 92 teams. Yeah, our diverse team of engineers collaborates with um, the scientists from the Sandia National Labs and experts from Houston. So our commercial journey started with Cycleton Road in 2015, and yeah, that really accelerated us in a different atmosphere, so thanks to Elon for all the support and mentorship. Since then, we received funding from NSF, uh, the Navy, and the US Wave Energy Prize. And because of the great performance in the prize, we then received a $5.4 million contract with the Department of Energy to demonstrate our technology in open ocean. And for the 20% cost share, we received uh, funding from break Breakout Labs and currently looking for 500K convertible nodes. After the initial demonstration, we're looking for yeah, high value markets like offshore drones or islands. And after that, wave power can yeah, provide up to a third of global energy demand and CalWave has finally a solution. So please visit us at calwave.energy or see me afterwards. Thank you. Hey.